Hi, this is Dr. Gary, welcoming you to the Daily Tune-Up today. Today, we're going to talk about thinking, we're going to talk about problems, and we're going to talk about panic. You know, we hear the news every day, there's a lot going on. We have everything from enjoying the trappings of the royal wedding, to people losing their homes, to nuclear disasters, tsunamis, earthquakes, also economic challenges. You know, one of the things that people do not understand is, because we're living in this time right now, that this stuff's really kind of been going on forever. It's just that we're hearing about it all the time now, and it overwhelms us because we get too much information too fast. Listen, if you're a little bit uncomfortable right now, that's not a bad thing. However, it's not smart to go out and hoard gas at four, five, or six dollars a gallon thinking it's going to become ten. It's not smart to hoard food since the prices are going up. Here's what's going to happen with that. Some smart retailer out there is going to come up with an idea and a plan to sell food less expensive than anyone else does and make it even more convenient to get your hands on it. That's what's going to be born out of high food prices and the way we do things today. Some people will lose in business and some people will gain. With all the challenges and problems we have right now, all that means is there's opportunity to change things. And the people who really focus on what can they do to make it different today than it was yesterday are the people that are going to win. Each one of us have creativity in our mind. Each one of us know how to do a lot of things. Today I'm asking you to really buckle down, quit panicking, quit buying gas at four, five, and six dollars a gallon, quit hoarding food, put yourself an emergency preparedness kit together, that's smart, but hoarding food? It's time now to quit worrying. It's time now to quit panicking. It's time now to go to work. And if you haven't got a job yet and been out of a job for a couple of years and lost your home and have no money left, I think this is a good clue that maybe what you're doing right now isn't working. Change the way you do things a little bit and you'll be surprised things will change. Also change your attitude a little bit about and the way that you look at all of this and things will change. You see, all these challenges and problems we have right now are really nothing more than problems wearing work clothes. Today, I want you to wake up. I want you to really, really take a look out here because someone's going to come up with some great ideas. It might as well be you. And when you come up with those ideas, there's a lot of other people you're going to help solve problems that will buy them from you. It doesn't have to be magnanimous either. It can be small ideas that sometimes make the biggest difference. So today, I'm asking you to wake up, take a deep breath, relax, everything's going to be okay as long as you're not on the panic train. Until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary panic-free day. Bye-bye.